Lindsay's here. What are you up to? Ah, Michelle, I'm, I'm getting ready to go to the Camino again. Wow, I'm, 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 I'm packing. This is my pack, and I have all of this, and I'm going to put it in. You want to see what I bring? Well, sure, um, because I saw how small your pack was, so it would be interesting to see what you put in. How do I do this? Just your so. magical pack. You can, it's a bit like the TARDIS. It's a, it's definitely... <laughs> That's good. It's a bit like the third. Okay, so, um, so first of all, this yeah. is this is your pack. This is my pack. It's it's actually um, it's from this company called the North Face, and it's actually a runner's vest. Oh, cool. So it has this it has this bit in the front, and I put things in the front, and I put things in the back as well. And I like it because it it distributes the weight. Okay. I don't have this big thing kind of. Hanging out on my back. And it's a little bit ventilated as well, is it? Uh-huh. Oh, it's yes, got some I ventilation. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's, that's really cool. And it's actually fits... Actually, it's usually not full, even when I go. Oh, okay. And so these these are feathers I've actually gathered fly, on the yeah. Camino, yes. And this is my little Camino shell. And my Hawaiian flower, so I can feel Hawaiian -ish. Camino and this actually just has like little very lightweight um, shoelaces and little pieces of string in case I need something like that. Wow, okay. In, the, in case you need to trap a rabbit or something. Yes, exactly. <laughs> All those rabbits. <laughs> okay, so one of the things that um, I've worked at finding lightweight is little shoes for after I'm walking. And these are my latest. Okay. So they're just little light flip-flops light flip-flops okay and you have and these are those little bags that that you get at beauty parlors when you're they put go over your shoes and they can go over your shoes yeah shoe also covers. a wonderful thing you can use for this for any packing is those shower caps that you get in hotels okay you know those really yeah. light clear ones so often i have that but then i got these yeah so these i put in the very back because that's kind of my um like my frame. Okay. So that's in the very back. Now, I don't bring a sleeping bag, a sleeping sack. I found this on the Camino, and it was actually a sleeping sack made out of this, which, which is, is like a, a nylon, yeah. what do you call it, a nylon liner. But I took off the zipper. I actually yeah. just ripped it and made it shorter because it was more than I wanted to carry. So now it's just this. Okay. And then I zipped it up. I mean, I, I sewed it so I can go in it if I need to, but mostly I would just have it on top of me. Okay, all right. So you have a little sheet or something you can get into or put over you. Yeah. And it's kind of like a, and it's quite warm. Yeah. Now the thing on the thing on the Camino is that almost every albergue I ever go into, I get a, I get a blanket. Okay. The one that doesn't give blankets is the one in Burgos. The okay. big one, the big municipal, they won't give you a blanket. All right. I don't know if they don't have them. I don't quite believe they don't, but they don't let you have them. So you just sleep on the bed? You sleep on the bed and you have to have your own. Okay. So I had this last time and it worked quite well. I was not cold. Okay. And I get cold. So we put that there. So this actually is one of the things I put in the front because it's the heaviest thing, even though it's not really heavy. You can see how heavy that is. Yes, pretty lightweight. Yeah, and that's one of the things I put in this front pocket because I want as much weight in front as I can, again, to even it out. So that goes there. The other thing I have, like let's say it got really cold. Okay. I have a little, very lightweight down vest. Oh, that's super cool. Yeah. Whoops, yes. It's upside down. This is from Uniqlo. Yeah. Uniqlo is actually um, really good for lightweight things. Okay. And and it's it's in a lot of places now. Yeah, I've seen so these before. Okay. I have very specific ways of folding so that things fit properly. Okay, you do the folding, Tierra. Yeah. And um, I have little I have little light stuff sack kind of things because I don't want to be one of those people. Now I can't even find it. What I do with it? Okay, well we'll pretend I have it. And that goes on the bottom because I don't use it too much. And and 
They say, and you're a mountaineer, you might know about this, that you should have the weight on the top of your pack rather than the bottom. Like if you're going to have heavy things, have them at the top. Well, our packs are heavy. so heavy that sometimes <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't make much difference. It doesn't matter. Okay. Maybe it was in this. It must have been in here. That's what's showing. Oh, here it is. This is a little stuff sack for the... Now the other thing, so again, if it's, if it's going to be colder than I'm prepared for, I still don't want to have to carry something heavy because that's never going to make me happy. So these are leg warmers. Okay. They're cashmere okay. and they're actually from, um, I cut the sleeves off. Ah, uh, they're from a jumper. They're from a okay. jumper. Yeah. That's a really good idea. Yeah, it could and use they're some quite cashmere. warm, okay. quite warm. So that, and um, so if I'm sleeping, oh, here's the other thing. Now, here's my blanket. Feel how light it is. Ah, oh, that's super light. It's like, kind of like nothing. So you've cut this from a I've, I've piece made it blanket. as small as possible, and it's not big. Yes. It's actually quite just small. Just enough to it's cover just, you. Yeah, it's just enough if I curl up. And this, as you'll see at the end, I roll up and I, this pack is actually kind of big for me. So it's, it's too roomy in the front. So I roll this up and put it right here and then strap it over. But okay. you'll see. We'll put that to one side. Yeah. So then I also have little scarves. Okay. And this one, again, you can feel they're the lightest weight things I could find. Wow. So I can have them like sometimes in the morning, it's cold, so I will yeah. put them around my neck, but also I could pile that on top of the blanket. Okay. And, and, and have, so with all of that, I'm definitely warm. It wouldn't be for sleeping outside, but I don't sleep outside. <laughs> and then this one I just actually found on a walk near a pool, and I thought I'd bring this to start out, and then I don't like it that much, so I can let it go if I don't want it. Okay, this, so, that's so that's just a, a little idea. extra for yeah. on the plane, because the plane gets cold as well. Yeah. I actually bring this super lightweight red scarf, Yeah. because if I walk in July, it's San Fermin. Okay. In Navarra. Okay. And uh, that's the running of the bulls, but they have all these, all throughout July, they have all these different um, festivals of the same theme and I like to just sort of be a part of it and I'll wear red scarves and a white shirt which I don't always have the white shirt. So Tiara tell me about uh, one of the big things that I struggle with mm -hmm. is the toiletries. Okay that's a great this are my toiletries. I have these little and how long are you going for? This time two weeks. Two weeks okay mm -hmm. so you bring so little sachets. Yes, these are those kind of things you get as a little sample. Yeah. In in stores, they yeah. say, "Oh, try out our this yeah. or that." So, I actually have decided I don't need to wash my hair with shampoo. I just wash it with conditioner. Okay. And it gets clean, and it's going to get dirty every day anyway. So putting yeah. shampoo every day, it actually is quite harsh. And I like this. And okay. sometimes that's what I use to wash my body as well. So I have. And I kind of estimate, like one of these could be two days. Okay. Yeah, that's perfect. And then, and then, I then you them. have um, fa little face creams. And I have little face cream. creams. I have sun creams, and I have um, so you have body cream. You have no bottles. This is my body cream. Ah, oh, that's your body. Oh wow. Okay. Very nifty. This is my first aid kit. I have some plasters and some earplugs and this to go on my toes and it's just again it's just okay that's all it ear is. Earplugs are very um, important. Yeah earplugs are really good when you're in the albergue and this I actually have um, some ibuprofen some ibuprofen PM which I don't know they yeah, I get that in the states and it's it's ibuprofen Plus this stuff that's, I guess, for allergies, but puts you to sleep. Okay. So if it's really hard to get to sleep and they're snoring. And then these white ones are some magnesium, yeah. which is good for regularity and muscle aches. Okay. So I good. bring a little of that. Um, one little tiny spoon. Wow. <laughs> Lightweight. And this is the lightest weight pen I found this time. <laughs> this is my towel. That's a face lock, Tierra. It's not a towel. Yes. Well, <laughs> <laughs> it's very nice, but I have to, after I shower, I have to wa dry half of me and then and I wring it out and then I dry the other half. Okay. Of me. Well, still. It's that makes a... me happy. I'm not, 
you know, it'd be nice to have some luxurious towel, but it's nicer for me to go to have a very lightweight situation. So I walk with one pair of clothes that I'm walking, which is yes. this, which is a pair of leggings and a quick dry top. And this is a linen shirt to protect my arms. Okay, um, but because it's kind of cool as yeah, well. Yeah, it's very, very lightweight and linen is very yeah. breathable. So I just want to protect my arms. And then I have this to protect this part of me yeah. as well. Okay. And then when I get to the albergue, I have another pair of clothes and this is my current one. These are very cute. They're, they're from Desigual. So it's just another pair of leggings and a very lightweight top. This again is um, Uniqlo, it's called Airism, mm -hmm. and it helps you to stay cool. Oh, I see. Because a lot lovely. of times when I do the Camino, it's in the summer and it's quite hot. Yes. Okay, uh, I, now, yes. Uh, so what else? You've got other stuff Okay, here. so I have a toothbrush and toothpaste, but again, my toothpaste is in these little things. Okay. Um, this, I don't always do this, but this is my current thing I really love. I bring some protein powder and some little fiber. Okay. Because I, I like it and then I, I can eat no matter what. I think I might bring some little sleepy time tea. Okay. Because I had some with you the other day and that was grand. Here's another extra face cream that has an SPF. Okay. So okay. I like I that. that and these, this is my soap. It's actually two soaps. Yes. And it's, it's a nice, um... A nice organic soap because so I feel good about it on my skin. This a little a little loofah yes. for my feet because they do get. And this is just some little extra like a um, a little tinted moisturizer. Okay. And a, a lip, a couple of lip things. This is my razor in case I want to shave my legs. It's just the top of a razor. Okay. <laughs> good luck with that one. <laughs> so this is just these are actually not even essentials right here. But since I take such little amount, I give myself kind of girly things. This is um, charging. Okay, for your mm -hmm. uh, phone. I have I have my iPhone charger, and I have an extra one. I'm probably going to bring, but maybe not. And then this is an extra battery pack. Okay. Because yes. sometimes I, I talk to people while I'm on the Camino walking yeah. along yeah. or taking photos. So I do bring it. That's heavy, but I do bring it. And then I have, in case it rains, I have waterproof socks. Okay, These are made out good. of bamboo. Yes. They're breathable. And I walk most of the time with sandals, with hiking sandals. Okay. Um, so those I can just put on and then Very again little. my feet. This I, this I will use to put all those little toiletries in and that will go in the other front okay. of the pack. I have this my ankle because I have an injury that's a long time ago. This I found out the last you bring an umbrella. I bring an umbrella. This is actually a sun umbrella. You can see it has that silver. Yes. And <laughs> I was I was on the Camino this this last July during that heat wave. Yeah. And it was hot. Okay. It was like in the forties, in the hundreds if you're fair. Okay, so you can use this for a little and bit of shade. It was it was like being in the shade. Okay. I would put it up, and it was maybe ten degrees cooler. Wow! Plus, it was protecting my that's my a, face. I, I think that's a brilliant idea. I think that it's really brilliant. The, yeah. the Japanese do this all the time. Yeah. How big? Uh, let me see. Yeah, how big yeah, it yeah. Is. I, I, two things I like about it. It's it's lightweight. Obviously, you're not meant to open the umbrella in in this. Nice. Okay. Oh, so it has this. the silver, and because it has these like scalloped edges, the sun doesn't get it too much. Okay. And I actually discovered once I have my pack on, I can hook it in and it stays up, so I can still use my hands for my walking sticks. Very cool. Dude. I know, and I, I like it because I, I look kind of ridiculous, you know? <laughs> so it's just kind of funny to imagine me walking But tell me, tell me about the sticks. So Well, I've never used these until this year. Okay. And I was at an albergue and um, someone had left a bunch of things, people leave things behind all the time because things are too heavy for them. So you find, you find lots of things in the albergue. In fact, half of this stuff I probably found somewhere. But the sticks someone had left behind, didn't mm -hmm. want them, and the hospitalero gave them to me. And at first, I didn't like them. It was like really awkward. I wasn't used to them at all. Yes. 
And then I just kept going because I was walking and I had them. And then after a couple of hours, suddenly my body just got this rhythm and now I adore them. Okay. I, I like them, especially going up and going down. Okay. Because going up, you know, it's yeah. like this health and going down, it's the safety they feature. They can be an extension of your body. Yes, uh, and, and, and it's like this nice rhythm. Yeah. And you know, they, they say that, that it's better to do this cross crawl when you're walking. And if I don't have something in my hands, I tend to go like this. Yes. So yeah. I actually think it's healthier for my body yeah. in, in all ways. So that I like a lot. Um, sunglasses, and I okay. put one of these things on it so it just hangs. From and you have a bottle over there, is that? Yeah, this, these are, I love these little bottles. It's Solon, which is a, a brand in Spain, which I have even seen in other places, including yeah. Romania and Czech, and Czech Republic. Um, but they have this nice yeah. wide uh, um, yes. opening, so yeah. I like that. And this is, a, this is a small one. There's another size and another size. You okay. can just get and And how much water do you need to carry with you? As you're going along, you know, I just fill this up. There's there's fountains all along, not in Galicia, but in yeah. everywhere until Galicia, there are fountains. Okay. N you know, every so often. So you don't need to be carrying liters no, of water. No, I don't okay. carry. I don't carry anything but the bottle. And as you say, this is a pretty small one. Okay. I usually have a bigger one, but. Okay. Well, that's really good because yeah. that keeps down the weight as well. Yeah. And anything else we didn't cover here? Well, this is what I carry. So I have this on my back and then I have this here. Yes. And in here is my little money and my passport and okay. my pilgrim's passport. Yeah. As well as my phone. Okay. And this is just right here. Okay. Okay. Perfect. And then I have this and this is in the back of me. So again, I'm distributing, but I yeah. put, I put pretty lightweight things here. Like this is a... This is one of those super, super, super thin ponchos yes. wrapped in the super, super, super lightweight little sack. Ah, so when it's raining, right, yeah. what kind of, what do you do when it's raining? Well, now I have an umbrella. Okay. <laughs> ah, okay. The umbrella is good, yeah. But. And you have a, some poncho. And I, and I, these are those ones, you get them for like a euro. Yeah. You know, they're just those very cheap ones. In Pamplona, they'll cost you three euros, but everywhere else you can find them for a euro. This is just a super lightweight carrier bag in case oh, okay. I get some food or something. Um, it's, it's just, just a plastic Super, can. super light. Yeah. Now, if I were going in the rainy season, where I expected it to rain fairly often, I have one of those, um, it's like a super light kind of windbreaker. You yes. know, those really thin yes, ones? Yes, That's bigger in the back. Okay. It has extra space, so it goes actually over my whole pack and, okay. and myself. Yeah. But now with my umbrella, I just... Use okay. that and it and it works. And if my feet are getting wet, I put on my waterproof socks. Cool. So you're all sorted. So Tiara, I'm gonna leave you. Maybe pack it. Okay. And then we can have a look okay. at, at what it looks like. That sounds good. And uh, and the weight of it as well. Yes. Do okay. You, do you have a scale or anything? Yes. I'll tell okay. You what, I'm gonna go and get okay. it. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Michelle.